Ah, guys, this gig that we're picking up right now, it's six boxes, six. Jesus Christ, I gotta have to, um, oh man, I'm gonna have to make room right now. I picked up from him one time and it was like two boxes. This time it's six, that shit's only paying 17 bucks. Jesus Christ, that's, that's what you call robbery. That is robbery. So guys, I didn't get lucky with the roadie drafts this morning, so came over to the Walmart and I got one, $25, three shops. It's going seven miles, it's staying local, and that's why I took it, just to get the day started. The strategy won't have to change today. Let's get it. All right, guys, we're finally out. We did that shop really quick. They give us, I think, almost two hours to shop for that, and we did it in like, whatever time you see there, but we did it quick. <laughs> and uh, the first one is due at like eight something. And uh, right now I'm thinking I should do my business, then drop these off. I don't know. I'll, I'll just do what I can right now. Get it out the way. So. Oh, and, and one thing I have to address with Instacart. This is what I don't like about Instacart and Instacart customers. If you're shopping, if you're, if you're doing Instacart and someone's gonna shop the items for you, please do it properly. Please look for a replace, add a replacement or two. Stop being lazy. Add a replacement or two or note that you do not want a replacement if the item is unavailable. Don't have me in the store circling around asking a million rude employees where this is and they don't want to help me. You see what I mean? Put a replacement. Well, she did. She did for some of the items, but come on. You got, you got to back up your items, man. Back up your items and then the app's going to learn that you would like a replacement in the future. I, I realize that about the app. So it's really annoying when you're in there and you can't find the items because I want to find all the items. I want to find them. It's like a game. It's like a game that you want to win. I want to find everything. I, I feel better and I get paid the money that was shown to me. If I don't find all the items, then my money go down. It is a game. Let's play it right. Come on, customers. And tip better. For fuck's sake. All right, guys, let's drop off the first one with a quickness. Get out of here. This one is a uh, meet the customer. Jesus Christ, man. Please call me. Please ring the bell and call when you're here. God damn. All right, guys, you got that one dropped off. Now we have two more, 748. I gotta be home pretty soon. This one is due at 902, but I wanna get it off me though. It's not far away. It is not far away, it's in Elmont. <laughs> so it's 12 minutes away and I have to, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know what? I'm gonna head home. I'm gonna head home. Yeah, head home and then I'll drop these off when I have my wife, so yeah. I'm gonna head home. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna have my son go to school late just to drop off groceries. Guys, I'll be late. Where this is going, it's not far, but it's like a little bit out the way. And with the school traffic right about now, yeah. The school traffic uh -uh, is terrible. It's the worst traffic. So, yeah, I'm gonna go home. I drop these off after. Walmart and this time is for Walmart Spark. So all this paid $18, take nine miles, and we pick it up six items. Quick and easy. Let's get it. Alright guys, got that shop for now. Let's deliver. I had to go and ask them for some bags in the back because the store doesn't have any bags. But this shop took long. And Instacart did pop up for $62, but some of the items that I was shopping for, I don't even know what that store was, so I just let it slide, man. 
The worst thing is to be getting paid well, but you're miserable at the same time. And I, I don't, I'm not for it right now. All right, guys, the drop-off is only 15 minutes away. And yeah, guys, the fact that I had my wife with me too, I missed the roadie drops at 9.20 and I missed the BJ's drops at 9.15. Always distracting me, man, always, always, you know? So let's get this dropped off 15, well, 14 minutes, 9.4 miles, highway miles. Let's get that done and keep it moving, man. Jesus Christ, you're gonna stop right there, man. You can't. Jesus fucking Christ, man. These people make some, some real bullshit. And then you're gonna go have to wait for you to back into the, the damn parking spot. No fun, man. So many fucking spots all over the parking lot that you wanna park right there. Come on. Alright guys, so we dropped off that Walmart Spark order and we, you know, we just we, we just cruising today. So oh my god, yo. So um I need to go over there. Thank you very much, lady. So um maybe not. Yeah, not that one, but this one. So yeah guys, um I'm heading to Costco. I already hit start because I got the order when I was heading to the spark drop off, so I was kinda worried that they would take it away from me. It's kind of heavy on the miles, but it's going back to Queens and it's not a lot of items. It's only 10 items and two different customers. I, I already see that with pick. Whoa, whoa, for one customer. Oh my God. We're picking up five cases of water, the 40 count water. One and a, oh man. And for the other customer, we're picking up one case of the 40 count water. And we're picking up 12 1.5 liter water and a next thing of water as well. Jesus Lord. Whoa, that was a catch. You're picking up some juice, some diapers. We're picking up some gloves and some canola. Um some 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 oil. Jesus Christ. This is gonna be a monster. It's a lot of water, man. $38. I'm not worried about picking them up. It's about where the hell they're going. I am 100% sure these are going to buildings. Both of them. Both of them. Motherfucker, you see me coming up. I don't get people. You see me coming up. You see me coming up. You're speeding coming around. Like, part of the language, man. Part of the language. But still. God damn, this is a serious monster shop right now. But guys, the aim is to go in and bang it out like really fast. I don't want to be in there for over 20 minutes. That's the goal. I might need two carts, but the carts might be big enough, but it's going to be heavy to push. Wish me luck, guys. I'll see you in there. As a matter of fact, I won't be... Re Excuse me. I won't be recording anything. You're going to just see me go in and come back out because it's going to be heavy. And I ain't got no body cam right now. In the future, that'll change. I'll level up as time goes on. But for now, mm -mm, nothing. All right, guys, we have Costco. Let's make this fast. Guys, we finished with this monster small shop. This is a small monster. Look, damn. And guys, you gotta deal with these lines, man. Annoying. But it should move fast. All right, guys. So, oh, how am I gonna get out of here? Telling you, man, that shop was very deceptive. When I tell you about deceptive, these Instacart shops are very, very de deceptive. And I mean, very deceptive. They will come up as 10 items. But you, have to take your time and look at these items or else you won't know what you're getting into until you like start shopping 
because that's what happened to me. I see 10 items. I didn't, I see 10 items. I didn't look at the items. I just look at the money and the item count and I'm like, give me that water in my ass. Oh shit, pause, 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 pause. <laughs> but yeah, man, for real. Oh man, customer has four items, but five cases of water. A two big ass boxes of divers and a three pack of orange juice. The next customer got three different types of water, a case of, a, bo a box of wipes, two freaking canola oils, a box of gloves. I think that's it, right? Yeah, man. So bulky. I think the first one is going to a house though. I think the waters look like a house. That's what it looked like to me. Let me double check. Yeah, that's a house. Thank God. Thank God. I've used the hand truck, but thank God. Whoa. We're gonna make $38. Who knows? Maybe they'll up the tip because of my effort. I don't know, man. I don't know, but it would have been nice to get something else going that way. But I'm not really gonna risk it because I'm gonna be extra late and I need to improve my stats. So I'll be checking for Rudy gigs while I'm on the way there, of course, to see you know if I get anything lined up. Cause I need to line up something, man. Today's not been the best day. Jesus Christ. Today has not been the best day, but guys, I'm making things work, man. That's all you could do. Use the apps that you have at your disposal to make things work for you. That's the only thing you could do. Do not complain. Do not be, do not complain. Oh man, DoorDash is so slow. Oh my God, DoorDash is slow. Oh, Uber Eats is sending so much trash. Oh my God, Grubhub is so quiet. Guys, there's a lot of other apps. There's Instacart. There's always orders on Instacart, especially if you're living in a busy area. If you're living in a small town, it might be different. But if you're living in a busy metropolitan area, guys, stop complaining. Download these apps. There's so many apps out there that you could work. Download the apps, make money. I haven't even checked ship. There were orders on ship. Go. It's easy. It tells you exactly where the items are. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, I'm fed up with the complaining and the whining, man, and the bitching. Fed up. Go out there and make this money, man. Look at how I'm, look at how I'm grinding. I'm picking up freaking all this water. I didn't get a roadie gig this morning. But guess what? I didn't give up. 25 on Instacart, 38 now. Guess how much money? That, that's about $63. $18 Walmart spot. Guys, we're in the 80s already. The next thing we do, we might hit 100. We might hit 100 plus. And it's only 11.35. By the time I'm done dropping these off, I'll have an hour and a half to see what I could do. We're going to hit 100. And I'm going out later. I'm going out later. I have to. I got to make $200 today. Because I have a goal. Starting the week off with 600 for the first two days, and then we're gonna see if we could hit a thousand. We have to hit a thousand. We gotta hit a thousand or a thousand two this week for sure, without a doubt. Guys, see you at the drop offs. <laughs> All right, guys, 1156, we're here at the drop off. Let's get this thing done. Let's make it happen. Five cases of water. I think I'll carry them by hand. They're not going too far. You know what? Nah, I'm gonna use a hand truck. You know what I need? Maybe in the future, one of those hand trucks that I could push flat, turn into like that flat thing, whatever that's called. So, yeah. Guys, 
that was a workout. I don't know if it was the best order, but it wasn't terrible. Let me stop acting like it was terrible. We're three minutes away from the next drop off. What more do I want? It's bulky, but it was an easy shop and it was an easy drive on the highway. And uh, freaking drop offs are close to each other. What more do I want? 20 more dollars. <laughs> yeah, 20 more dollars. That would have worked. All right, guys, you know how I do it. And I got something else lined up. We're gonna make it happen by, listen, we, we gotta be savvy with it, man. You gotta be savvy with it. We're going over to Best Buy, picking up two orders. Well, one order, two drop-offs, and it's going to Brooklyn, but it's not like deep into Brooklyn. It's like over by the Bell Parkway area. So, um, basically, that's the east side of Brooklyn, I think. I think so, right? <laughs> So we also got a gig from a place called Creative Wear LLC. I've done a gig for them one time where I picked up two boxes of um, t-shirts, like they do like the printing and everything. And that was pretty smooth. So I got it. So this is equal in $40 total, which is really, really good, man. That's how you do it on road day, baby. That's how you make it happen. Did the Instacart, line up the roadie, we're making things happen, guys. Even though it's slow, we still gonna make it flow. Let's get it, man. Best Buy, Best Buy's been coming in clutch. And guys, just a trick with the Best Buy orders, right? The ones with one and two drop-offs, they are the best. Especially if they go in a distance and you already go in there and you can line them up with a couple more gigs. They are the best, man. You gotta be smart when you're using Rody. Thought I wasn't gonna make the money on Rody today? Think again. All right, guys, we're back at Best Buy. Becoming one of my favorite spots, man. God damn, can't believe it. I used to talk so much smack about Best Buy. Let's get it. All right, guys, we got those items picked up and I bagged the Instacart at the BJ's in the Skyview Mall, which is a couple levels down. I'm gonna just run down there and get that shop for maybe like four Dirty items. Dirty sack, baby. Maybe oh, like four yeah. items and yeah i don't even think i'm gonna move from my parking spot I'm just gonna run down a couple flights of stairs no 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 no. i have to i see water in that order <laughs> so yeah let's just go down a couple levels and make it happen 18 bucks let's get it let's get it all right guys we have bjs i parked in the back there we're picking up just a few items all BJ's are basically laid out the same. Let's run in, run out, make it happen. All right, guys, we gotta pick up two of these. Let's get them. So, guys, we picked up these rotisserie chicken. Oh man, they were the last three. Goddamn. All right, guys, we need a box of this, and then we need bell peppers. Hey, what's up, Tally? What up? Anyways, let's go. All right, guys, just like that, we got those things shopped for five minutes and we should check out really quick and get out of here and go pick up the next roadie order jesus christ man listen move people making money all right guys we are 16 minutes away that's what it's saying from the next pickup <laughs> We're running out of time, let's just say that. So once you pick that up, it's gonna have to be boom, boom, boom. Everything dropped off like, you know, especially the orders in Brooklyn. I'm not really worried about the orders in, um, what you call it, the orders that's going to Queens, as I think the Instacart is going to Queens. I'm not worried about that too much. Let me see what the drop off time is. 1.26, we're gonna be late for that. We're gonna be late for that, definitely. 
definitely going to be late for that. 20 minutes to the pickup. Jeez. Time's flying, man. Time is flying. I got to be home by 2.20. I have some time. <laughs> Let's just say I have some time. But you don't want to play with time. I just want to secure the other roadie order. Once I secure that, I'm good. Ah, guys, this gig that we're picking up right now, it's six boxes, six. Jesus Christ, I gotta have to, um, oh man, I'm gonna have to make room right now. I picked up from him one time, and it was like two boxes. This time it's six, that shit's only paying 17 bucks. Jesus Christ, that's, that's what you call robbery. That is robbery. Oh my God. Oh man, they didn't even know. Oh yeah, there's a parking spot right here. Let me see. Damn. Let me see. 18, 18, 10. Let's go down to 18. We'll have to move around a few things man because i put the seats down i don't know why i did that <laughs> but i put the seat back up i mean we're gonna have to fix that we we'll have to do this fast because i'm running out of time it's 109 click arrive and let's go Terrible. Let's get this Instacart order dropped off first. This is terrible. This order is not worth it. I'm going to have to contact Rody about this order. This order is not worth it, man. Seriously. It's too big for the money. Way too big for the money. So Instacart, we gotta be there in 10 minutes. Gonna be late, but let's go. <coughs> 23 minutes to the Instacart. Let's do the Instacart. And then we're gonna focus on getting these boxes out the fucking car. Seriously. Can't even see anything. Oh my God. Oh, guys, look at the state of this. Look, 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 look at what's going on here. Look at what's going on here, man. This is insane. This is insane. I never expected these boxes. I never expected so many boxes and I never expected it to be so bulky. This is not good. For 17 bucks. Wow. So guys, now I'm thinking about it. I don't think I'll have enough time to actually drop these off in Brooklyn and come back. So what I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to go home. This is this this is gonna have to be the plan. I'm gonna have to go home. Get the hand truck off off my person. I need the hand truck out. Get the hand truck out. Get the seats up, fit these boxes in the back here, have the seat for my son, and wait for him to get off the bus. And then once I have him, I'll just go and deliver these things. That has to be the plan. If I have to go up in a building, I'll take him with me. It's no big deal. But I can't risk it. I cannot risk it. I cannot risk going to Brooklyn 
and rushing back to catch a, a bus in traffic. You see what I mean? It would be dumb. I should have never taken this order. This order is not worth the money and it's not worth the hassle. Six big boxes filled with clothes and it's probably going to a school. And I won't be able, let me say this, I won't be able to deliver these like, like you know, I, I'm gonna have to, hey, somebody gonna have to come and take these in. I can't bring them in. Ah, so th this is a dilemma. <laughs> This is a dilemma. This is definitely a dilemma. Got my son, he's gonna get home around 2.25. Gonna be on the bus 2.25, he's gonna be there. Sharp, not gonna be late. If the bus came at three, and I stood a chance, but 2.25, maybe I should have never taken that Instacart because it added time to the trip, it added time to everything, to the drop off, to the pickup, it added, I would have been, I would have been good if I didn't take that Instacart order. Greed. Greed, man. Greed. 147. I don't have a lot of time to play with. And these boxes are huge. If they were a little smaller, you know, I would have been able to finagle, <laughs> you know, and make things work a little bit better. But these boxes are big. But I'm going to make it happen. It going to work. It going to work. That's what I do. I make it work. All right, guys, we don't have a lot of time and we had to find the building. So I found it. This is the same thing that happened to us the last time we got here. The map does not know. The maps do not know where these apartment buildings are. And I'm really short for time. And I'm mad that I have to come all the way here and take this shit all the way to the fucking apartment. But I think they're living on the first floor. I might be wrong, but... Damn, oh my God, the cart's coming in handy, yo. Jesus Christ. Guys, invest, invest in some equipment when you're doing this type of work. You won't be able to do it without it. Guys, yeah, just like that, we are done with that order, the Instacart. Let's drop off these roadie orders. I do not have a lot of time. I'm really strapped for time. And if I had the best buy orders alone, I won't care. But these boxes, they, they gotta go, man. They gotta go. I gotta get my son from the bus, so these boxes gotta go. All right, guys, you made a few shift arounds. Had the car seat there, the one box up here, one box here, four boxes in the back, hand truck in the house, and I ran the numbers. So Instacart today, 82, 87 coming in clutch. Dodash, we got some adjustment. Pay 37, 37, but I'm not adding it to today's total. Spark, 18.76 and Rody, 40.86 when we complete these for a total of 142.49. If you add that to what we made yesterday, which was 407.80 because a $5 tip came in late, so I didn't get to tally it up. I think the bus is coming. And uh, that equals 550 29 plus the 37 37 We had 587 66 for the week, guys. We're killing it, we're killing it. And when the Uber Eats adjustment pay comes in, that's gonna go over $600. So, you know what? I'm not gonna go out later. I'm not going out later, guys. That's it. The adjustment pay is my little gravy on top. And the Uber Eats adjustment pay would, uh, you know, balance everything out. I'm going to use the time to edit some videos and uh, get my mind right. I got to go see my daughter later. It's her birthday. But, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you new like the video. If you haven't yet done so, let me know your thoughts down below. And until my next one, I'm your boy, Dom. This is Gigabyte NYC. Peace out and Godspeed. Sorry to leave you so abruptly. That is not the bus. That is not the bus. So I wanted it to be the bus because I want to get on the way to drop off these things. Uh, anyways, yeah, I'm not going out late. I want to settle down and edit some videos and get these videos out. I need to get them out. I need to get them out. I need to get them out. You know, I need to catch up, man. You guys need to know what's going on currently. Like I've already done 71 Instacart orders. And I haven't even released one Instacart video yet. Crazy. Anyways, guys, I I'll talk to you. <laughs>